Night, let there be sun. Let there be the Beatles. She was a day tripper, a one way ticket, yeah. It took me so long to find out. But I found out. She's a day tripper. She took me half the way there. She was a day tripper. A one way ticket, yeah. She took me so long to find out. But I found out. So anyway, what do we have here, basically? It's a new day, the 14th, Friday. I was thinking about, oh, I gotta just prepare for that bump. I was thinking about doing some characters, you know, doing acting. Since, um, since that should have been one of the things that um, I should have been getting better at. Should have been concentrating on that. If I want to someday sell out a huge haul of some sort or anything, I mean, I mean, when you're young, all right, let's talk about memories. All right, when you're young, you're always in the present. The present. You're always in the present. When you get older, the older you get, you're in the present, but you're surrounded by a lot of memories. Lots of memories. I think you see what McNamara has. Mostly cloudy, a mountain flurry, or a patch of freezing drizzle in spots. Do, 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 your memories, you know, being able to, um, you know, hold on to things, you know, it's a, it makes you a complete, you know, healthy, genuine person. We all know that. That's to be true. I mean, it goes without saying, you know. I'm just if you just constantly work towards a better day, even retirement. I'd like to congratulate our cousin, but he's not on our friend list. But that would have been nice. Well, at least we got to congratulate Carmela. We didn't get to congratulate Mon John. You know, I don't really run into him. It'd be nice. I mean, the last time, you know, I, he he helped. He helped mentally on this show. So it was it was a few years ago, and I was doing some really crazy crap. But I was also doing too many, too many videos in the morning. I was doing it in my room and it was, it was, oh my god. I mean, there was a lot of misses. Definitely a lot of misses. You know, I, I understand that, you know, but I was, I was trying to be a sport, not a sport person, um, oh, sports, yes, let's go to the sports. So, uh, exhilarating game, indeed. First, we have to have our coffee here. So it was 28 to 14. Kansas City was up 28 to 14. And I just had this feeling. I had this feeling that the Chargers were going to win. But, yeah, I said the Chargers. Okay. And sure enough, you know, that one drive. I didn't know there were like a 10 and 3 team. I thought maybe they, I thought like they were like down and. More like the Redskins or something, maybe six and seven or you know, even lesser. I, ju I just you know I'm not, I'm not following sports like I you know like I, I, like I used to do or whatever. I, that was memories. That was playing football with Monjon and Pat and Dominic. His nickname was Mono. I used to be O.J. Simpson. O.J. Simpson. Now if you ever watch Good Times. There was an episode with uh, JJ where he was talking. I mean, because in the you know, I mean, because memories. You, you you watch as a kid, 
say you watch it when you're a little older and you, and you, and you hear all the stuff that's going on in that time I guess they were talking about a lot of things like Jesse Jackson and stuff like that and um, I don't want to I can't think of is it Theona his sister something with it I think it's the old Theona 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 so you know they you know they you know they argue like back and forth you know but it's love I mean Christmas comes you know you have memories Thanksgiving comes, memories, Easter, birthdays, this, that, with family. You know, times that you might have had disagreements over the table and everything like that. I mean, what TV wants to show is like, you know, normal things. How you should be running your lives. And we've seen a, an emotional exchange when Chris Como was handing it off to Don Lemon. Because Chris Como interviewed uh, Kelly Ann Conway. Yes, and I, I woke up and I, I went to comment on uh, Chris Como's page, and I seen you know some, I seen this girl like you know because he didn't have the video up, and the girl was commenting saying, "Wow, you really took her to town, like you know you exposed her to all her lies and this and that," and I just I just happened to say I said I said I think that she she took him to the cleaners, and then someone else comes in like you know so I'm having a little thread and I go back to it it's gone. All right, that happens a lot. You know, I don't go to these pages that often, but I, I when I do, I just go just to get a feel. I mean, a lot of people just go and comment on all these things, but you notice. I mean, depending like you know where you where you sit on uh, on issues and things, they know they know right away. You could just say it in a cute way, you know, a little satire, you know, a little sarcasm. I mean, where it could go either way, and they know. And they just go over to your profile, they check, they look. No, they scope you out in minutes, man. They scope you out. Because if you ever go over there, because there's people there with just fake profiles or whatever, just profiles just to go and just swear and yell. Yell, get it out of you. You know, that's what we've been working on here. I mean, people that have been listening to this show, we're trying to um, get all your news and, and and your health needs and your memory needs all all, all in one shot and then you'll know I mean does it is it does it help to go over there and say it to get it out I mean what, what benefits does it really give you all right here you got two options either someone agrees with you or they disagree with you so what are you going to feel? If they agree with you, okay, they agree with you. Do you feel great? Just like this thing we have going on here with, with impeaching Trump or putting him in jail. Now we have campaign financing. Okay. Good. Now we have the family. Family's being scrutinized. So when Chris Cuomo handed it over to Lemon, Lemon's like, you know, he's going right at it. Well, they had like a 10-minute exchange. It was uh, so sad. It was all about, did... Kelly get the best of me. No, no, he's like explaining it. No, she didn't. She didn't get the best of me. And Don's like, you're right. She's a liar. She's a liar. She's a liar. She's a liar. Why do people do that? They shouldn't be allowed to come on this show and lie and lie and lie. All right. Neighbor, the neighbor says, well, Joe, the next dream, that neighbor next door, said he saw the guy yesterday. Mm -hmm. He just testified to us. He never saw him yesterday. Right. Well, at that point, you're in trouble. But any reasonable person would look at that and say, well, you know the FBI is doing an investigation because they came to your door to ask about okay. a murder. So, um, so yes, I was um, looking at a few things. I mean, I also have um, my Uncle Jerry. I have a few relatives up that way that are not on here. But, but back then, in the day, yes, a lot of that stuff I was doing was crappy. But, you know... It was something I was doing. I had the time to do it, and all, all the things indicated. It was like, okay, <clears throat> now we have Johnny with a Westlight radio page, and we tried that back in the day. I had a West One radio thing. Um, I don't know. I don't understand why we just can't keep it over here. You know, like get up and explain. Like, let's just start a post. Like, you know, I do the show in the morning. I listen to it, and then I come back. 
maybe I'll I look at briefly look at the morning show or the CNN and look at it and just say I was right you know I was right I was right right on the money no one even noticed it but you know I can't be you know time is a valuable thing and you can only do so many things at once and I see you know people have to manage their pages too they got to do things you know, they got to put something up they look for ideas they're not on here all the time I mean I shared I because I'm in the area I'm in I shared a lot of mutuals like two years ago I shared a lot of the same mutuals that everyone on here shared but in those two years you know, I was talking to a lot of them and the thing is I too want support I too I'm not a bad guy. I'll do whatever. You got a gig. You got something in mind. You want to talk. You want to play football. You want me to do karaoke. Do you need help? Does anybody need help walking across the street? Do you need your groceries put away? You know. Do you need anything? So, you know, I started talking to people and everything. And, uh... You don't get any support. I have... All these, like I think, like memories. Like the show today is about memories. When you're a child, that bump. I, I mean, that they should put a monument around it. That thing's been there so long. Yes, the city. Well, whoever we have here, we have. Whoever's here is here. You're going to enjoy whatever we have. We don't know what the future is going to be like or bring. But we are... are are here we're attentive we're ready to do whatever we got to do we can't seem to find the degree we don't know what we did with it it could be down the river it could be somewhere up in troy i don't know or it could be my house somewhere and i remember i was putting in the book in the yeah the book bag the bring to do a video and that's the last it wasn't where i, I usually put it or yeah or where it's placed I couldn't find, well, what's the big deal anyway? What's the big deal? Maybe someone is already working in the field with it. They, maybe they just brought it in. Maybe there's someone being me. That's good. Like that Michael Jackson song, you know, another part of me. Obligation ...to provide the defense with any exculpatory evidence. In December of last year... Uh, we don't want this, McNamara. Yeah. Uh -huh.